All right, formally starting up. Um, those of you joining me on the stream, those of you joining me uh, on YouTube after the fact, thank you for coming. Uh, we are, of course, once again, streaming Morrowind, and I'm, I'm trying to remember where we left off last time. I will have to check the journal to see what the hell was going on. Oh, right! So we got two two things uh, we need to worry about here. One of them is the Thieves Guild quest, where we have to release new shoes from prison in a rather underhanded and scheming way. And the other is uh, we have to do a, a favor for Hasfat Antabalus before he'll tell us anything about the main quest uh, information uh, uh, about the Nerevarine, right? That's what we were asking about. And he wants a favor done first. Um, It'd be... I know it's not... Uh, it's not a common thing in Elder Scrolls games, but it'd be kind of cool if there was... If you were... I mean, I'm not skilled at speechcraft, but if you were skilled at persuasion or whatever, uh, if you could just say, like, Hey, come on, dude. You don't need the dumber puzzle box. Just tell me what I need to know. Cut out the, the crap, huh? Um, but anyway, we need to go to Pelagiad, and we need to go to... Arkenfand. Head south, out of town, past the Siltstrider port. Then cross bridges east. Over the Odai. At the signpost. Head north. Okay, we're not going to remember all this. We'll just have to... Um, but yeah, wait, wait, wait. Let me check the map. What's, what's more on the way? Like, wait, what's, what should I, what order should I do this in? That's Monmouth. Caldera. I, have I been to Pelagia? I have been to Pelagia. It's right there. Um, an Arkham land is, I forget where that is. Let's, let's not dither, though. Do you want something from me? No, thank you. We're fully rested. You've got the better of me. Uh, what time of day is it? God, I don't understand why, but I swear to God, the volume gets turned up every time I leave this game. Look at that! It's so loud! Honestly, I'm, <laughs> I'm sliding this bar down and it's not doing anything. Because it's... Ugh, God, okay. Turn that... There, that, that works. Master Slider does nothing. I don't, yeah, Frankie, I don't know that I necessarily want to be able to dodge every quest because I've got, oh my god, because I've got high speechcraft. Um, but I would kind of like it if it was an option for players who were really skilled or could, could, Jesus, could, um, I need to go south. Could, what's the word I'm trying to say? Could uh, cleverly come up with some way to boost their s speech skill, like a uh, potion or a spell or something like that. Like, if you could do that, you should get a, a bit of a reward by being able to skip. Uh, not the entire quest, but the, the fetch part of the quest. Hi, Fletch, how are you? Ooh. Oh, that's not a place to go. Uh, yeah, Morrowind's map leaves a lot to be desired. I think, actually, Oblivion's map, uh, with, with a couple mods, of course, um, kind of hits the sweet spot. In both, and still looking kind of, uh, authentically like a map, but also having a ton of information that you actually need to use. I know vanilla, it's not all that great. Um, but I like it better than Skyrim or Morrowind's vanilla map. Now, Skyrim with that, I forget which map mod it is, but the one that makes it look, the fancy new one that makes it look like paper, that one's really cool. That's the perfect um, map, I, in my opinion. 
I don't know why they have to get fancy with their maps. Like, just make a damn map. You gotta go to Pelagiate. I'm pretty sure it said to go this way, right? Yes, Publican, you're absolutely right about naming conventions. I need to check the directions again. Ugh. Okay. Uh, cross bridges. Signpost. Head north towards Cardair. Immediately on the right, see a signpost for Molegmar. See, now that's helpful. Immediately on the right. Okay. We headed north of the signpost for Caldera. Does that mean that this... There's no signpost here. But it did say immediately on the right. Should I be going up? Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Hey, check me out! Oh my god. The gods are angry. But I know where I'm going. This is fantastic. Okay, I get it. I don't even know what time of day it is. 9 p.m. Oh, shit. I should probably walk for a little bit. Allow me to marvel for just a second. Uh, allow me to marvel for just a second. The fact that this can be so goddamn close. Hey, Nicholas, welcome to that. Yet, just the small act of walking up this hill makes you feel like you're in a completely different. Oh my god, completely different area. Look, from here you can't see it. You just. You have no idea that it's there, unless you've just walked past it. You feel like, oh, I'm not in the middle of nowhere, when there's actually a freaking town right over there. Fort, rather. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't even have... Uh, I don't have any fatigue or anything. Oops. Bring it, bubs. Ow. Oop. Ow, 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 you bastard. Son of a bitch. Quit it! Ah, he killed me, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, I don't even remember when I quick saved. Fuck, I wasn't even out of town yet? Should have quick saved on the hill. Another thing that I sometimes can't believe, even though I've played video games since I was... I don't know, uh, god, seven, eight years old? Yeah, the guy on the bridge sucks. Uh, seven or eight years old, and... Uh, it still kind of amazes me that a computer can recreate a three-dimensional space and allow you to move through that space. Like, it just seems nuts, doesn't it? Like, it's just, it's just hardware. It's just plastic and metal and, uh, and plastic and metal and electricity. But somehow it's able to do this magic box it can set up this imaginary world that I can walk around in. It's kind of something like I take it for granted uh, when you turn on a game and start playing it because it's just always a factor. Well, not always, but in any kind of first-person or third-person game, it's always you're always walking around in a world. It's just kind of nuts that you can actually represent space inside of a computer simulation. Right, so I forgot about that. Start climbing the hill and the weather freaks out. My first video game. Oh, uh, probably Super Mario Brothers. Nintendo. Nintendo came out when I was like four or five years old, and I, I never had one myself. But I remember um, all my friends and my babysitter's kids having it, so we played a lot at their house. And then the first video game that I owned myself was probably... Um, 
Oh, it's not even one that I own. My dad had a PC in 87 or 88, which was not super early, but pretty early on as far as PCs go. I'm going to... Um, as far as, you know, IBM compatible PCs go, I'm going to let my fatigue uh, recharge here before I tackle him, which will give me a chance to finish this thought. Uh, so, uh, that PC could play really, really basic games like uh, Battle Hawks 1942, Battle of Britain, uh, Battle Chess, not a battle game, uh, a weird ninja game called Bushido that was kind of crappy, um, and a, oh, look at me, oh, rats under the mouth, and a, um, the very first Teenage Ninja Turtles game. Um, but, the game that really, truly was the first one that I played with any kind of regular intent was probably Zork, which was a text, text-only adventure game. What have I got that'll help me out here? Big fat nothing. But I could probably eat some food. Okay. Give me that, and a little bread. And what the hell, some monster. It's pitch black, you are likely to be eaten by a Gru. Exactly right, my man. Gru's, uh, the, the, the lean and hungry gentleman, the thief, uh, the troll that you had to fight with your sword that began to glow with a faint blue glow when you got close. Pointless, eh? I'll show you pointless. Ha! This is going horribly. <laughs> oh, and the cliff racer wanted to join in too, huh? Uh... Yeah, Zork was really fun. And I, I'm not... Oh, the cliff racer wants to tangle. I'm not thinking that... They would really be a... What in the hell? Where are you? You're stuck. Oh, come on. Hit him. What am I... Hang on a second. Always use best attack. Okay. I'm just not hitting with it. Come on, you bet. Iguana. There we go. Got him. This would be an epic fight if I wasn't awful at it. Lightning storm on a bridge. Thunder going off all around. Oh. Finally. Can't even... You don't exist. Okay, fine. <sighs> well, I, I seriously don't know what I can do here. I got nothing. Gotta get across the bridge, though. Ooh, I've got a thousand gold. Do this ahead of time? This isn't exactly role playing, but. Right. Uh, do I have another? I have another one. Apprentice. Yeah, all I was going to get from it was racer plumes anyway, which I don't really care about. I need a strategy for this fucker, though. Can my strategy just be run past him? Wait a minute, do I have the silver? I don't want the silver longsword, I want the... Oh! When did I pick that up? Did I buy that? I must have bought it. It's better than the... the uh... Steal a short sword. Okay, fine. Sure. Ugh, God. Alright. Where is this bozo? Oh, there he is. He was invisible for a second. And his head's on backwards. <laughs> okay. Oh, ow, that spear. 
the hell? <laughs> oh, game. Oh, uh, where is it? Health. I'm looking at it. I looked right at it and moused over it and everything. Dude, what in the hell? I can't hit you! Oh, for fuck's sake. Dude, what's happening? What is happening? He's impossible to hit! His head is on backwards! I don't like this at all. Oh, there we go. We got a hit. Should I just keep going with this? I guess. I don't know. I kind of feel like I should just die and start over because this is stupid. <laughs> just the fact that he electrocuted me and I froze and fell with absolutely no sound. That was pretty funny. What the fuck happened to this dude? If his head's on backwards again, I'm gonna have to reload a previous save. No, nope, his head's good now. Alright, die, asshole. Jesus. Wait, I don't wanna drink six of them. Hang on. Oh, fucking hell. Up. Let's see what you're made of. You mages are the worst. I'm dead. I can't do anything. I cannot defeat him. Ugh. Maybe I'll just run. Just try to run past him. Think that'll work? I'll have a hell of a time getting past him on the way back, but... Let's rock! And by rock, I mean let's just charge past him and hope that he can't hit us. Serpentine! Serpentine. I'm gonna do what Rickon Stark should have done. See ya, sucker! <laughs> oh, we gotta turn this crank here. Let me in, let me in! Phew! Okay. It's gonna be dark in here. It's pitch black. You are likely to be eaten by a guru. Alright. We're saving it. We're looking for the Dwemer puzzle box, and I gotta admit, I don't even remember where it is in here, so this could be fun. Surrender now! Come get me. You can waste all your fatigue trying to get up here. Ha 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 ha! You fool! Ow. Yeah. Actually, we seem to be pretty evenly matched so far, and I have potions. Come on, fight. What do you think I'm doing? For me. Oh God, is there another one coming? Good news is, by not fighting the guy outside, I saved all my potions. Oh yes, there is another guy coming. Hang on, boys, hang on. Back off, back off, back off, back Ow, what the hell? Let's see what you're made of. Ugh. Come on. Dude, would you die? Thank you. Fuck. <laughs> Ugh. I hope this dungeon isn't bad. This is, like, all my health potions just to get in the door. 
Hello. Do you see me trying to hit you? I'm trying to hit you. I'm holding perfectly still. God, this is so <laughs> aggravating. <sighs> it's all my health. This is it. This guy's gonna kill me. <laughs> oh my god. We're gonna do that again, you guys? Actually, oh, it crashed. Morrowind crashed. I think my last uh, save was on the other side of the bridge anyway. So I'll have to run past that freaking dude again. Who was it that suggested I stream Morrowind? Who was it? I don't even remember. Oh, did I quick save inside? What? Immune to poison. Uh, I don't know if that's a good, that seems like a bad thing to me. Okay, hang on one second, I gotta minimize steam here. That seems bad. Does it not? That kind of sounds like something's busted. I'm just, I'm sneaking because why the hell not? Maybe I can, I don't know what I'm going to do. It's not going to catch these guys asleep or anything. Maybe I can only face one of them at a time, though, huh? Or just go right past him. Yeah, bow and arrow would be nice. Uh, I didn't even think of that. And I can't... I don't remember, do I have... Eh, marksman's a minor skill. Huh. Better sneak, just in case. Okay, torch. like lower than the subway. Oh, crap. Well, if there's only one of you, maybe I have a chance. Nope, not if I keep freaking missing. Ha! Get that. And that. Ow. Is he hissing at me? This is literally my, my best skill, and I'm awful at it. Short blade is 42, and I suck. Okay, I think we can take this guy, maybe. Mm. Wait a minute, I am using... Oh, duh. Of course. I was wondering why. I'm like, I don't remember arming that. I didn't buy it. I must have picked it up somewhere. Thinking I would sell it, and then I didn't sell it. That's what I need. And I probably also need this. Let's go. You and me, buddy. There we go. That's... No wonder I was having such problems. Thanks, Frankie. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Common. Pa. I have an exquisite belt on, I'll have you know. Or was it an extravagant belt? I don't even remember. Cells of hollow hand. Well, 
Yeah, that, that made a huge difference, didn't it? I could probably... I wonder if I could take that dude on the bridge now. Oh! <gasps> oh! Freaking diamond in there? So these dudes have obviously moved in some equipment so they can live down here. Weeping Bell Hall. Well... Oh, God, that sound. One place is as good as another. Oh, actually, hang on. <clears throat> I know, that's not going to get me much healing, but it's something. Oh. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Yes! Okay, finally! Pemguana's back, baby! <laughs> Damn, I was wondering why I sucked so bad. I was like, oh, this game is just un... unforgiving. But that's why. Nah, that's not better than what I got. Heaven's Gallery. I'll probably come back. This is closed off. Thank goodness that I'm doing this in a stream. Can you imagine if I was Let's Playing this by myself and I just stood there forever trying to fight people with a shit blade? Mm. <laughs> mm. I'm dying. Mm. Well, trapped, huh? I'll be the judge of that. Well, no, not the judge. I'll be the, the, uh... What the hell are they? They won't be, won't be trapped after I'm through with it. That's what I was trying to say. There we go. Better put the sword back, just in case. blocked off up above. I've kind of lost where I am now. It's not a torches. Good grief. Oh yeah? I'm feeling very confident now. Ooh, okay. Shouldn't have felt that confident. She landed a very good hit there. Maybe I should take another one of these. Okay, you ready? Ha ha! Oh, I don't have my torch lit. Hang on. You guys can't see anything. Yes. Spear, lady. Nah. Uh, worth a lot, but hard as hell to get out of here. Heavy. Oops. Nothing. Uh, nothing. Hello. Oh, hello. Hall of Centrifuge. I'm gonna get lost in here. Ooh. Oh, this, it's you. You're the dude I fought before. Ha 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 ha. Yes, I'm stronger now. At least you look like the dude I fought before. Frank. Well...
Oh, okay. Yep. So that's the Weeping Bell Hall, huh? Um, okay, so then we have to go back to... What's it called? The One Heaven place. Heaven's Gallery. Ugh, god, that's a freaking awful sound. Yes, come do that. Where are you? God, it's very loud in here. Do I have to actually jump down there? Die, scound oh, die scoundrel. Oh, uh, so, no, there was something in there. Okay. Uh Coins worth a lot. Where are you? Okay, I'm gonna go for it. Haha! <laughs> yes, they all say "wha." Yeah, they should. You can get mods that add spears, at least in Skyrim you can, but the animations are the same, so it just looks goofy as hell, which is kind of a downer. Yeah, I, well, yeah, yeah, I think I can get behind that, Diablo 2. Acrobatics as a major skill. Um, you know, I didn't even look what dagger he had. Let's let the fatigue restore and actually let's take a health while we're at it. I really like doing with this with you guys. I'm glad that I get to do this. Um, I told my my wife. Uh, oh, oh, that's right. Uh, maybe you guys don't even. Oh God, this is gonna suck. Maybe you guys don't know this. Uh, <laughs> uh what do I have? What do I have that can get me across this thing? Um, my my longtime girlfriend and I got married this summer. Um, it was kind of sort of not our plan to get married at this point, but her health care uh, through work changed, her health insurance, it got really shitty, uh, so uh, instead of just pay more money for shitty health care, we, um, we got married so that she could be on my health care because my work doesn't have a um, domestic partner benefit. Oh, shit. I'm gonna fall. Ugh. I don't think I can get Dead. Thank you. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, so, uh, I... That's a long roundabout way to say that we, we just got married. It was just a Justice of the Peach situation. We didn't, um... have a big, big party or anything like that. We're going to do that. We're gonna do that probably next summer with family and friends and stuff, and we haven't actually even told any of our family that we've gotten married because this, what is this even doing for me? I'm not going to be able to get over there. And I'm going to fall. Oh, 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 eh. Ooh. Uh, yeah, we're saving it all for next next summer. We haven't even told our family that we've, well, I guess some of our family knows. But... Oh, yeah. Oh. Good point, publican. I uh, didn't think of that. I'm pretty sure none of my family's watching. Oh, sorry. That was actually Walter that said that about my family. I, your text, your message changed just as I was looking at it, so I got confused. Thanks, Licorice. Uh, 
it's it's honestly not that big of a deal. Like like I said, we haven't announced it to anybody. We haven't gotten any gifts or anything. We're not going on a honeymoon. I'm not even wearing a ring um, because we plan to exchange rings. Ah, oh, this is stupid. Why am I even trying to do this? Huh? Hey, Carl. Uh, I might have said girlfriend. You know, we've been together for 12, 13 years now, so sometimes I refer to her as my wife just because it's it's easier. Like, it, it explains our relationship better, describes our relationship better, because she's not... I've called her just my girlfriend, or I've called her my fiancé, but that's not really accurate. I can't go this way. We're going to come back. Um, it's not accurate to say to say just girlfriend, because that's not what she's been. We've been together for a long time, we have two kids together, we're basically married, and, well, we, before we were married, we were basically married in all ways, but officially. <laughs> yeah, this guy's fun. What do we got? Iron dagger, and nah, nah, nah. It's very dark. I know I only have one torch left, though. Yeah, basically it was <clears throat> it was common law, so... I don't actually know that it was common law, because I don't know what the rules are in my state. <clears throat> but, in effect, we were in a long-term relationship. Neither one of us was going to go anywhere. Um, oh god, I keep hitting the wrong goddamn button. We were committed to each other, we have kids together. Um... So sometimes, with people that I don't know as good good relations, I would just say that she was my wife, because it was easier than trying to explain, well, she's my girlfriend, but you don't understand, we've been together for, ooh, for a decade plus, you know. Yeah, Carl, it's, <clears throat> we, we kind of, we backed into our relationship for, for sure. Um, we did the whole thing backwards. She got pregnant. Uh, we would we were actually barely even dating. We've been dating for about uh, three months <laughs> when she got pregnant. Hello, what the hell? Uh, and then we moved in together after that, and then we had a kid together, and then we had another kid together. And then we bought a house together, so we, we did it all backwards. You're not supposed to do it that way. I cannot unlock this. What in the hell, game? Let me just load a quick save, see if that fixes the problem. This might take me back a little bit. No. It takes me back to... I don't even remember what I was doing here. Check... <sighs> Takes me back to here. I'm right over here now. Yes, I agree with everything that you guys... Oh, okay. I agree with everything that you guys are saying. Uh, I think to, to our generation, or at least my generation, and everybody younger than me, marriage seems to matter less and less. Uh, as, a, as a gesture, it's more so like, okay, well, we need the tax break. Fucking hell. Is it because I'm trying to activate it first? I don't like this. Yeah, it's more so like a financial decision for, it feels like, my generation. I, I don't know. There's still plenty of people that get married for the, for the joy of it, I'm sure. Shit. <laughs> Respawn with none of the goodies that it had before. No, I can't. Alright, whatever. I don't understand why that is, but fine. It can't be done. Let's see what's this way. Blood gallery. Well, I don't know that it wasn't a thing until Christianity. Oh, I'm using a probe. Oh, for fuck's sake. 
Thank God you're here, publican. Um, yeah, Walter, that's exactly the situation that I would describe myself as being. I was using a probe. Thank goodness you're here. You guys, I would be lost without you. Everybody watching on YouTube right now is like, Jesus, dude. If I can't tell you what's wrong, this is really boring. <laughs> there we go. Ugh. Ooh. That's that's hard to get out of here because it weighs a lot. That's worth it. Um I would not say that marriage really wasn't a thing until Christianity got involved. I would say that Christianity probably got a monopoly on deciding how marriage should work, at least um, amongst Westerners, Europeans, and their descendants. But marriage has been around since the first time that people realized, holy crap, women are actually, like, important. <laughs> and I don't mean that in a mean way, but... Like, to a... Yeah, okay, this is anthropology, Pem, talking here, but... To a culture where... You are... What do you think about human beings being, like, tribal and hunter-gatherer and, and having no sense of, like, medicine or... Anything like that. Uh, which of the two sexes is more costly to lose? Uh, it's it's females, right? Females have uh, female reproduction requires a nine-month gestation, whereas male reproduction just requires, you know, sex. That's the only contribution the man makes. The woman actually is the incubator for the oh god for the child. Holy shit! What are you? Oh my god. Uh, so this is a really weird conversation to have during combat. Oh, shit, I need silver. Wait faster now. Um. Oh, come on, you bastard. I don't know that I even have any healing left. No, I don't. This has got to be it. This has got to count. Ugh, fuck. Okay, anyway, so let me just finish the thought that I'm trying to say here. Um, from a biological perspective, females are more important to reproduction than males are. I'm not trying to make any kind of claims about culturally what's more important, or um, like how things should be. I'm just describing how they are biologically. And once people, once humans figured that out, um, protecting females became a priority. Because losing a female is way more costly than losing a male. Because multiple males can provide the um, what's needed. Whereas, you know, if you lose a female, you've lost. You lose a male, you've lost almost nothing. If you lose a female, you've lost something huge. Uh, so since that time, females unfortunately started to become treated like property. Because, oh right, I don't even have the right weapon armed. Because uh, they were protected, and so their fathers uh, basically claimed them as their own property, and marriage became a property transaction where, the, God damn it, where the male was passing along the female to the other male, and so that's why, like, the the your surname changes when you get married. It's because you're woman is actually changing hands. She's stopped becoming her. She's no longer her father's property. She's, not, she's now her husband's property. Again, this is just descriptive of history. This is not some kind of prescription for how things should be. I do not believe that women should be treated as property. But it can't be denied that historically they have been, and that's the reason why. I want to fight just the fucking spider. I don't want to fight the ghost... Uh, with the spider. I'm gonna keep walking here. Yes, sneak. 
So that's why marriage became a thing, because it was like, hey, women are important, we need to protect them. Uh, so let's, when somebody agrees to take care of a woman, let's make sure that they freaking stick to it, right? Can you handle stairs? You can't handle stairs. Can you handle stairs? You have to be able to handle stairs, you just came upstairs. I switched weapons too early, and now I'm gonna suffer for it with less health. Oh, I can't wet rest because that guy is right there wanting to kill me. Hi, 8-bit. Uh, right, what am I saying? I think I finished the thought. I think that was it. Marriage. That was all a long digression about marriage. Where did that ghost go? Where the hell did the ghost... Yes, it was important. Well, um, I guess it was important for marriage. I'm gonna die unless I get really lucky, which I am so far. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, fucking hell. That was close. Um, yeah, it was important to inheritance in the sense that you wanted to be sure that the kid that you were giving your stuff to was your kid, uh, from a man's perspective, the, the man being the property owner, historically. This is not every culture, but this is most, cu most cultures. Uh, the man being the property owner, he wanted to give what he had to his offspring. He didn't want to give it to some other dude's offspring. And given that women could sneakily sne sleep with multiple men, and the men would never know whether the kid was theirs or not, unless they were confident that their wife had not slept with, the woman had not slept with another man. So marriage became a, hey, look, you commit to me, I commit to you, you don't sleep around, and I'll take care of you. Uh, and the idea was that if they were married, the man could feel very confident that any children that were born were his, and therefore he could give those kids his stuff when he died. So I guess it was important to inheritance, uh, in the sense that you wanted to make sure that, shit, you wanted to make sure that your kids weren't somebody else's kids, that you weren't being cuckolded. Fuck, I'm gonna die. I have no health and I have no way to get more without resting, and I, it's telling me I can't rest. I suppose I could go back to a previous area of the dungeon. Did I save it? I hope I saved it. Can you go through doors? <laughs> Hello. Oh, he's gonna totally kill me. Although he hasn't tried yet. I don't know what he... <laughs> One punch! Uh, Mississippi, I don't know what you are doing there. I think that's a bot. Let me see if I can do something about that. Uh, what am I doing? How do I? What? The, hmm? I'm just gonna clear the chat. Clear the chat, everybody. There we go. Okay. Sorry, dudes and dudettes. I think I'm gonna backtrack and try to rest. I don't know that I can. What's this way? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck! Two of them! God damn it. Alright, bring it. You're gonna kill me. He was almost dead. Um...
Alright, don't even go adventuring elsewhere. Just back out. Back the hell out. Okay, can I rest here? Shit. Where the hell are the enemies? Are they way out at the front? Can any oh, I can't get back up. No, wait, I can't. here. Ooh, okay. Um, alright, let's take a, whoop, damn it. Take a chance. Ha! Ah. Okay, probably need to eat some food now. I'm an egg, uh, and some bread. Okay, back to it then. So, my god, that was a really long digression, which started with, hey, I'm really glad that I get to do this with you guys, and I have my, my wife to thank for that. She's the reason. I, I'm sure I checked this. Yes. Oh! Something different this time. That's interesting. Ghosts and spiders. See what's this way? Trap door. Trapped door, not a trap door. Uh, Walter, she likes Mario. That's it. She doesn't really play anything else. She's really good at Super Mario 3, which I'm awful at. Um, yeah, that she likes to play it with our kids. Um, sometimes, yeah, we sometimes we play it like as a family over an evening. Which is fun, but that's kind of all she likes to play. She's not really into games. Um, I don't honestly know if we have a mod or not. I will check here in a second. Dead. Okay, hang on one second. Let me check the mod situation, shall I? Oh, give me the freaking cursor. There we go. Uh, nobody's a mod. I can ban you guys. <laughs> How do I make a mod, though? I forget. Maybe it's in the viewer list. Uh... Follow and friend. Mod user. Does that do it? Frankie, you can be a mod, and how about um, Publican? I'm not trying to pick favorites here. I'm just saying I think that you guys are here through most of the... Um... Yeah, Frankie's a mod. I'm sure. I'm assuming Publican is. Uh, you guys are here through most of the streams. So that's why I'm selecting you. Um... Oh, Frankie, you went to check it out. Okay. Very brave of you. we got down here. Feeling a bit better now that I'm healthy. You have a sword. Wait, was this trapped? No, just locked. God, I'm so confused in this game. Probes and lockpicks. And they all kind of look the same. Armor cylinder. Armor right pauldron. That's very good. Okay. 
I'm sure that I could tr uh, hotkey these things, but I I haven't so far. Oop, wait a minute. Fire assaults. Publican has power. Ash assaults, sure. So there's nothing else in here? It's just this, huh? Okay. Well, we got some loot. I'm pretty sure that I have uh, mods already on my channel. I think that Variax was a mod, and I'm pretty sure that Malarkey was a mod. But, given that they're not here, I needed to recruit some new ones. Okay, let's go this way. Because we know what's over here. At least we know what's over here right away. It's a freaking spider and a ghost. Come on, you prick. Nah, nah. Uh oh, the ghost wants me too. Can you guys even see this? I don't know if you can see this without a torch. Um, switch to silver dagger. Ha ha! How do you like me now? Ooh. You bastard, you're punching me. You're punching. Oh my god, I'm gonna die! Fucking hell! I had full health, and he still punched me to death by a ghost. Where am I now? Okay, I've been there. Double teamed. Yeah, I know, I'm just trying to take him on one punk at a time here. Alright. Screw it, man. I won't go that way just yet. This is going to take up the entire stream, this place. There's a ghost here, isn't there? No, maybe there's not. Empty space, empty space. Oh, it's them! Son of a bitch. Um, okay, let's let the fatigue build up while we think about this. What I really need is a wane wane? A ranged weapon. Uh-oh. Maybe I can just fight you, not the spider. Dagger. Come on, you bastard. One more fatigue. Ugh, oh, god damn it. What an asshole. Here comes the spider. Come on, quick, quick. Okay, fine. Alright, 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 alright. We can do this. We did it. We freaking did it. Jesus H. So wait, where, where haven't I been yet? Been everywhere, right? No. Well, that that I know, but I know that's not a thing. Um. Been over here, because that's the way back up to over there. Have I been this way? Been this way, because that's the 
lava room over there. And then there's this way back to the orc passage. Oh, I haven't been here yet. Uh oh. Okay, let's let fatigue restore until this guy sees me. Dormer spiders in this game are way more organic than they are in Skyrim, aren't they? Like, that guy's got a... he's like... breathing. He doesn't mind that I'm standing here. Let's save the torch. Yeah, you're right, Publican. Very dramatic. And very long, too. I keep thinking, like, oh, I gotta hit him again. Hit him again. He's still standing. Alright. Let's try this. Hello. <laughs> that hop is cute. Ooh, that looks like a place I'll need to go, huh? Ooh. Okay. Hope this is where we need to be. Or is this just the main... Well, that torch burned out fast. Is this just the main room? No, it's not the main room. Uh oh. Good. Didn't even touch me. So really, I only have to worry about ghosts, probably. Which I'll probably see here in a minute. Let's uh, just walk to restore some fatigue. Oh, doctor. Come on, come on. You come to me. Okay, this is going all right so far. Where the hell? Did I stand on you? Don't even let him land a punch. No! No! Oh, God! I needed one more hit, man. Damn. Alright, well, we know we're facing a ghost next. Get that ready. Let's walk. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Walk, I said. Walk, I said. Let's sneakery. Where is this thing? Oh, there he is. And there's a spider down there. It's two spiders, even. Uh, come on. you, dude. Hang on. Uh, give me another torch. Shit, here come the spiders. Oh, God. This is not going well. Dude. Did I kill? I think I killed him. I might need to go back and heal. Uh, let's just try that. Damn, damn low light. Is there a brightness on here? Speaking of. Uh, oh, turn this shit up, man. Be a 
little bit lighter. I don't even know if that makes a difference. Need to go back and heal. Costs of doing business with... Oh, what? Oh, what the hell are you doing up there, you bastard? I can't get you. I'm moving on. Anyway, I was going to say the cost of doing business with no healing potions. Can I wait? I can wait. Probably need to eat another meal after that, huh? Crab meat. Okay. Where is it? Where is it? It knows it wants to kill me. It's still up there. Duh. Get me off the rock. Come down to me, you jerk. Okay, down now? You're down. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Kill it fast. Kill it fast. Phew. Okay. Silver? Silver. I'm mainly sneaking now just to rebuild my fatigue. But also to be super secret. Oh, crap. I don't know what saw me. But hopefully it wasn't both of them. Definitely the spider. And the ghost. Okay, fine. Well, this should be fun, huh? I'm just going crazy! Ow. Ow. I'm dead. I can't take them both on. I can only do one or the other. Oh, good. Okay. I can do this. I can do this. Come to me. Come to me. Come on. You're gonna use up your Magicka, right? You must have, like, huge reserves. Here he comes. Actually, maybe I just wanted to use his magic because he's kicking my ass. God damn. Huh. What do I do? I'm not tough enough for this yet. Caius, why'd you send me out here? Get that now. First game I played ever? Can't say that I do, actually. Where the hell? First game, I, I, like I said, I probably, probably Mario. Super Mario. I really liked to play Excite Bike when I was a kid. Come on. Keep landing hits, baby. Ouch. Okay. Nope. 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 Fucking hell. Do I have any fatigue? I have very, very little fatigue left. Okay, there's a there's a freaking uh, spider that wants to kill me. 
Where is it? I'm gonna save it, even though this might be stupid. Ugh. Level up? Really? Ah, no! Come on! Thank you. God damn. Yeah, what I'm working with here is definitely not working. Egon would be perfect. That'd be great. I'm gonna go back and rest again, you guys. This is stupid. Need more healing. Whoa. Yeah. I When I was a kid, I always wanted a freaking arcade cabinet in my house. Thing. I thought that was just the coolest freaking thing in the world. We went over to... My dad uh, was a cabinet maker and carpenter. Oh, I was... Uh, that's right. I leveled up. Um... Take all the multipliers again. Uh, and he would do side jobs for like friends of his or friends of friends of his. And this one time he was doing a side job for a guy who had this really nice house with like an indoor pool and all kinds of stuff. And so he took us over there one day because my mom wasn't able to watch us for some reason. My dad took me and my brother over there. And his basement, he had like four arcade games. He had Frogger, Pac Man, um, What is Galaga? Gal Galaga? Galaga? Is that the game with the, um... What's the game with the meteorites that are flying towards the center spaceship thing? Anyway, he had that game. He had, like, like four of them in his basement, and we just played them non-stop. It was awesome. Of course, we got to play them for free, because they were in his basement. It was so fun. And actually... <laughs> It was funny because what he had was, uh, he had a, um, you had to put quarters in it, but he basically just opened up the asteroids. That's the one I'm thinking of. Asteroids. Thank you, Publican. Um, he basically, uh, he would just unlock the cabinet front. So when you put the quarter in, it would alert the machine that it was, you were playing it, but then you could just grab the same quarter out and put it back. But anyway, he had like buckets and buckets of quarters that had been put into this machine. So we were just reusing the same quarters over and over again, my brother and me. And I was like probably eight. He was four. Uh, ben, my younger brother, Ben. And um, when we got home, my dad was like, Ben, why are your pants falling down? And Ben's like, huh? <laughs> my dad feels Ben's pockets. He had loaded up with coins, with quarters. He just shoved as many quarters into his pocket as he could. When we left, he stole like $25 from this guy. My dad was like, what the hell, man? <laughs> You got to play video games for free at this dude's house, and you stole $25 and quarters from him. So we ended up, of course, taking it back. But Ben had no, like, he was four. He had no idea why that was wrong. He's just like, uh, what? No, I thought this seemed reasonable to me. We gotta be getting close, right? This has gotta be close. Do I have to get wet? I guess I can get wet, can't I? I'm a lizard. Oh, pinball machine and a pool table? That sounds awesome. Oh, right, I have to cast water breathing first. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. And I've forgotten how to do that. There we go, R. Anything down here I can take? Pool table is still something, even as an adult, like if I can... If I can get a pool tail someday, I feel pretty damn good about that. Thanks, Walter. Glad you could make it. Thanks for stopping by, and uh, I'll see you next week, I hope. What the hell is going on in here? There's nothing in here. I gotta get up there. How do I get up there? How the hell do I get up there? Oops. Oh, that was stupid. No, can't 
climb up that. There's no way. Must have to come in some other way. That's... Th oh. This is the way that I have to go to get... I have to get over the lava. Don't I? I have to go back to the lava place. Or I need a potion of... Rising, whatever it's called. There's none of that around, is there? <sighs> well... Came this way for nothing. Rising force, that's what I'm thinking of. Don't have it. Maybe there's something up there. If I can only get up there. Can I get up there? Uh, no, I can't. <gasps> Wait a minute. Let me up. Let me up. Let me up. I don't think there's anything up there, but I'm almost there. I kind of want to get up there. Damn. So somehow I gotta get across that lava bridge. That's what I'm learning anyway. Oh! I haven't even been in everywhere in here yet. Uh, okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Shield. And I'm out of fatigue. No, I have some fatigue. Oh shit, another spider. How did these guys sneak up on me? Unarmored? Where did it hit me that I'm unarmored? God damn. Okay, I will deal with you in a second. I need to restore some fatigue first. By which I mean I just need to stand here for a minute. Those of you who have played Morrowind before, which I'm assuming in this chat at least is probably everybody, you will tell me, of course, if I'm wasting my time by going in completely the, the hell? Completely the wrong direction. Come here, you bastard. He's glitching out. He doesn't know what to do. He's freaking out. Of course, I can't hit him, so it doesn't matter. Thanks, dude. Oh, you were stuck on the door. Thanks for being so cool about it. Cold lizard toes. Oh, you're right, Metropolitan. I'm probably cold. Are Argon are Argonians cold-blooded? Do they ever mention it? What in the hell? New enemies spawn every time you leave, don't they? Shit. Do they? I don't know. God, I've been in here a long time without finding any goddamn puzzle boxes.
cold-blooded according to UASP. Thank you. That's informative. Well, crap. You guys. Oh, I don't know. Oh, wait a minute. I haven't been up here yet. Hollow hand. Sounds like maybe that's where I need to go. Should we try it? Let's see what you're made. What the hell? I have no fatigue. Um, this would be interesting. I'm not trying to escape. I'm gonna kill you. This is gonna take forever. Yeah, just kill me, dude. You're gonna kill me, and then I'm gonna respawn, and then I'm gonna rest, and then I'm gonna kill you. Watch. Uh. Yeah. Watch this. Actually, hang on. Do I have more hammers? I do. Oh, not a one. Not one. God damn. Okay. I'll take it. Let's see what you're made of. Now you're gonna get it. All I have to do is rest, and then I'm fresh as a daisy. Ooh, that, that did hurt. I'll give you that. Boss Crito, huh? Scroll of Undusi's Unhinging. Open 40, 60 points on touch. Expensive belt. Eh. Summer mug. Goblet. Bargain fire resist. Eh, sure. What the hell? You never know. Potion of Shadow. Sure. Rising Force. of Dispel. Thank you. Hmm. Bam! I didn't have to go through all that shit. <laughs> I did it for no reason. I didn't even see that door. Well, okay. We did it. We found it. We just gotta take it back to... Uh, Asfat... Hasfat. Hasfat Antabolus. Uh, Carl, have I ever had long hair? I guess what... Uh, it depends on what you mean by long hair. I have... had hair that was over my collar, yes. Uh, but nothing that ever needed to be put into a ponytail or anything like that. Uh, I didn't recognize I could go deeper into the dungeon, use the Rising Force potion to get up to that one area I couldn't reach, or to jump over the lava thing, but I'm gonna pass. We got what we needed. Let's get the hell out of here. Um, I've had both longish hair, where it's kind of gone over my ears and over my collar, and I've had... Um, I don't know what would you call it. Oh! Didn't even notice that on the way in. Uh, and I've had super short hair, where I've cut my own hair for months at a time and just buzzed it all off with clippers. Okay, so is this motherfucker going to be out here ready to kill my ass? I'd be interested to hear why you 
wanted to ask that question, Carl. <laughs> Let's see what it's like this time, bubs. That's still gonna be kind of hard, isn't it? Damn, yep. Hmm. I do have... Do I have, like, a scroll of domination or something? Lesser domination. Command humanoid, six levels. Do you think that guy's under level six? What, what, is, uh, Carl, what's typical of Asian hair, would you say? Like, I know, like, uh... Caucasian is usually straight or slightly curly, like African is usually pretty tightly curled. Is there a typical Asian hair? Just very straight, I guess? I don't know. I don't know if that's gonna work. Wait, is that my spell? What is that? Was water breathing, right? Yeah, water breathing. How do I arm the spell? I don't know that there's three of those, okay. I don't know. Like straight, thick, very difficult to push back. Ah, okay. I didn't know that that's a an Asian thing. I don't know how to cast scrolls. Maybe I can just kill this dude fast. Get out of my way, skeleton. Ow. Bastard. Oh, to the right, of course. Yep, I'll try that here in a second after he kills me. Unless I can kill him first. Come on, come on. Oh, dude. So close. Okay. You're right. Thank you, Metropolitan. Thank goodness you're here. That one. Let's see if it works. Was it on touch? I don't even remember. Um, wait, did I do it? I didn't. Oh, I did do it. <laughs> okay, that gave me a slight advantage, I guess. Do I have my shield? I do have my shield. Okay, good. Ow. Fucking hell. Nice moves, dude. You're good. I'm stuck. I like fighting you like this much more than when your head was on backwards. Die, 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 you used up all your magicka. Die, no, you're not gonna, you're gonna kill me again. I'm trying to kill you. Why would I give in? Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, fuck you, Cliff Racer, don't you dare. Uh, wine or whiskey? Hmm. You know, I drink almost exclusively red wine. But in the last probably two years, I have become a pretty big fan of both Irish whiskey and um, bourbon. You know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to sneak back in there and rest again. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yeah. Um, Irish whiskey, I like uh, Jameson. Bourbon, I really like... Uh, what's it called? Oh, God. Why can't I think of my favorite bourbon right now? I'll drink Maker's Mark if if I have to. I mean, not if I have to. I enjoy it. I, I'll drink it. Um, but no, my... F oh, Basil Hayden. Basil Hayden, my favorite bourbon. Um, yeah, only within the last year, year and a half, have I actually been able to drink bourbon without, like, wincing from it. Um, but now that I can, it's nice, because it's actually fewer calories than uh, wine or beer. And um, it's just kind of easy to drink because you just pour yourself a little bit and you're good to go. Okay, everyone, this is where we're going to end this part of the stream. Uh, Morrowind will finish here. We'll have to do the Hasfat and the Thieves Guild quest the next time. Um, God, look at that monstrous dwarven room we were just in. I just poured myself a glass of wine. Indeed, Carl. That's the last of the last of the half bottle that I have, so this is going to be it for me. Um, but we're going to end the stream here. So, uh, those of you who are watching on YouTube, join me next time for more Let's Stream Morrowind. Those of you who are in the stream with me, uh, bear with me just a moment while I get things set up for... Um, what is it called? Banner Saga. Uh, this is five, isn't it? I should have done 05, oh well. <laughs>